Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you are using QuickBook Desktop and want to know how to import or export your charts up account, edit it in Excel, make some changes, add some other account, delete some account, this is the video for you. Whether you are an accountant, bookkeeper or a small business owner, I will guide you how you can uh, manage charts up account like a pro. So let's jump in. Now I uh, am in my QuickBook Desktop. So in previous video, I show you all tricks about charts of account. In this video, we will know how to import uh, and export the charts of account. So uh, let me go here in the charts of account. This is my charts of account, as you can see. But I want to export it and then edit it uh, in an Excel. So there is an option. You will go to File and then you can go to Utilities and then this an export and the list to IIF file. So I'm gonna get here and I'm gonna select a charts of account from here and OK. And then uh, I'm gonna name my charts of account. I'm gonna save it here on the desktop. Name it charts of account. And then your data has been successfully exported. Okay. So as you can see, this is the file we have exported in my desktop folder. So uh, this is not remember there. This is not an Excel file, and you cannot open it directly by double clicking it. It's, it cannot be open. To open it in Excel, we have to open an Excel file and drag it to it. So I have this Excel file and then I want to uh, drag this down to. Uh, so I'm going to select it and drag it to the Excel file and it can be. Now this is all my charts of account. So I need to close this file and this is all my charts of account. Now I'm going to make some edit again. We need to add some accounts, one to two account. So I'm gonna here accounts. So this should be the same, and this should be my account legal expenses. I'm gonna name it, and then the number should be you have to write down so, and this should be the same. And this is expenses, and this is not be the same. You can so what is this about? This is a date, so it's some not important and this is a description so it's just for demonstration and then account number should be different so above is 200 i'm gonna and it is 8100 so i'm gonna 250 make it whatever and 315 i don't know what this is about but i'm gonna change it to 316 and all other things should be you know control d so uh, that's it. That's um, um, uh, I have one account, and then I have to just save it and then export it back to uh, QuickBook. Okay. So this is just for this demonstration purpose. I add only one account, which is this account, and we when we export this back to QuickBook, we'll see that this account will be uh, appear there. Uh, so you can download this and make a lot of edits, adding a lot of uh, you know copy accounts, some other file, whatever, and just pressing then uh, you don't have to manually enter one uh, one by one account in a QuickBook. So I'm gonna save this. This is saved. Okay, and then uh, we can we can check it if it's saved again. We can open it in Excel file. So let's check it one more time. Where is my? Yeah, drag it down here, and let's see. Yeah, I have this legal expenses. So close again, close again, and then go back to QuickBook, and again goes to File, File, Utilities, and this time goes to M4 and select IAF file, and OK. Import IF, and I'm gonna select my this. This is my file, and open. Okay, so it's importing now. Well, oh, this is not import important uh, related to the success item. You just close this and open your charts up account again. Okay, and we should see our edited file here. Yeah, this is our file we have added last time. This is the number legal expense, and now this is our own file. 
so that's it guys that's how you can export and import charts up account to uh to an access file not an access file uh actually but to an i uh, file and open it an access file and make some changes then and import it back to the quickbook so if you like this video hit the like and subscribe button and uh, thank you for watching